Hi everybody, Jordan Steele 88 with another video. This is a Pirates versus Braves series recap, so let's get into it. Start with the first game of the series. Pirates lost that third game of the series, 6-1. to one. It was not a very good outing for Martin Perez on his return, because he gave up six earned runs in four innings he's pitched. Give eight, give eight hits and only got four strikeouts. Just overall, one wasn't a good game for Martin Perez. And the bull, bullpen, only, bullpen only did pretty good by not allowing any runs by Jeffries and Holderman. So the only run came from the only RBI that came from one person that got an RBI was Keith Ryan Hayes. Because Troy Morton, the former pirate, was shutting it down pretty much. So, but it was that in the um there are any when the um when the Braves went on that had a five run inning because that Osuna guy smashed up smashed a base clearing double with the bases loaded. That's what did the Pirates in. So the part, that's the first game of the season that the per, first game of the series, excuse me, that the Pirates lost. Let's move on to the second game of the series. Pirates lost that one two to one. That's in extra innings. I lost in, in extras. Well, Paul Skeens got no decision today, but he pitched a pretty pretty good game. Paul Skeens um pitched six innings, only gave up one run. That was a solo home run, and he got nine strikeouts. Because ever since he got up that one run, he, he put up zeros throughout five innings out of the, out of the, out of the one inning he he pitched. I mean, the uh, Pirates, they got chances at runners, runners in scoring position, but they left 12 on base. Not good. Because the only, only uh, RBI that came up was a sack fly by Orvaris. <laughs> so, and then going into to the um, extra innings, the Pirates, they, they, had, they had a chance to take the lead when Orvaris came in at home plate, but they said he was safe, but the umpire overturned and said he was out. We're no stranger to, to home plates in Atlanta. No stranger to that at all. But so the so um so the Pirates end up losing that one two to one in the second game of the series. Let's move on to the third game of the series. Pirates won that one four to two to avoid a sweep. Starting pitcher Barry Falter pitched a pretty good game, although I didn't, didn't watch the game. But Barry, but Barry Falter pitched a pretty good game. Went five innings, gave up one on run, and five punch outs. And only walked four, walked four batters. And the bullpen did a pretty good job, although Royce Chapman gave up that one run in a safe situation. And guys like Nicholas Majeski put up zeros. Majeski, if I say his name right, excuse me. And the offense, the home runs are coming from O'Neill Cruz and Riley Tulles. I mean, Riley Tulles has been pretty good in the month of June. He had a pretty good month of June, man. So, because the home runs are coming from, like I said before, before Tulles and Cruz. So, those were the are the arbiters that were coming from, from, from Cruz and Tulles. So, only left six on base, which is okay. So that so surprise won that one four to one. They avoided sweeping this series, but overall in this series, the Pirates lost two out of three to end this month of June. Now tomorrow they got a, um they got an off day, and then they got a, they're going they're back for a homestand against three against St. Louis and four against. The New York Mets gotta get revenge on, the, on those Mets, though. But we gotta worry about we gotta focus on on the Cardinals for three games. So, and going back to that home plate call, man, I, I can't understand that at all. I just can't understand why we get so many bad calls at home plate against the Braves. Going back to the Sid Brain slide and that controversial call when Jerry Mills called this guy safe in 2011, and now this. 
I don't get that. I don't. I do not understand this kind of stuff at all. So anyway, we lose the series two out of three in Atlanta. Now we got to now we got to start taking at least two out of three against the Cardinals at home. Try to get revenge on them. So let me know what you think down in the comment section down below about the series recap that I talked about. And other than that, that's all for this video. This is Jordan Steele 88. See you guys in my next video. And as always, let's go Bucks.